Hey, I'm Josh Vosco and we're back in Minecraft and I've been a little bit busy. I've been planning for our, our build, which we're going to start today. Um, let's go outside and have a look. I've also, I've also had a few shaders put on. I say a few, one shader put on. But how beautiful does this look? Like, it is absolutely, the lighting is stunning. Um, and the water, I need to take you down to look at the water. Look how beautiful that water looks. Just lovely. Uh, I do want to gather some of this for some sugar, so we'll take what we can. I don't particularly want to take it all out. I'd like to leave the bottom pieces. Like, look at this water. Who wouldn't want to swim in that? That is just lovely. Uh, you and you. Thank you, very th thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I'm going to get... I want to do some building, but I want to get some different types of trees as well. I like the idea of different textures and colours and things like that. So, it's sort of going to be an exploration building episode. I know exploration hasn't been my forte so far, but my plan is to make a bed and, and be sort of cautious. I'm, I'm, my plan is not to go anywhere which is likely going to get me killed. Yes, that, that's the plan anyway. But let me show you what I've done. So, I've been looking at what we've built so far and it's very straight and square and I've got a banner, look. Two men came and attacked me so I killed them and took their banner and now I've put it up there as glory so they can see it from wherever they came from that I took their men out. <laughs> oh, hello chickens. How are you? Oh, loads of eggs. Let's go and grab some eggs quickly. Because we're going to need some of those for cooking, right? I'm sure that's the case. That gave us three, so that's not many. But I would like some pumpkin pies to take with me because they're really good. So yeah, everything's very square. So I've watched a few sort of tutorials on building and that. And we've come up with this area, which is where we're going to build into. And already it looks stunning. It looks so good. So we've got a path that runs up here. We've got a path that runs all the way up here, up to this top layer. There we go. This is probably where we're going to base our house just here. I want to get some farms, probably. Like a stacked farm, maybe. Maybe. I might use, I might extend this air. I don't know. It's a work in progress. And we put a wall in, a retaining wall, as it were. And it looks, I love the planting now. Where it's not completely square. It's got a bit of growth to it. And it's just lovely. I'm really looking forward to building even more now. Um, but as I say, I would like I would like some more different types of wood and things like that. So I'm thinking we're going to head through the ice city, as I call it. And hopefully find some maybe um, evergreens, I'd imagine, in the snowy, snowy areas. There must be trees over there somewhere. Hello, donkey. You're of no use to me at the minute, but one day you will be. Uh, so yeah, that's the plan. It's a new day. We're all prepared. We've got a bed. We've got some food. We've got iron tools. I've used pretty much all the iron I had to make this, but I think it'll be worth it. So we're going to go off over this way. I've added a couple more roses to that as well, and I think it just looks lovely. Just beautiful. Mr. Donkey, how are you? Right, we're going to head into the Ice Town City. I have no idea what to call it. I'm sure there is an official biome name. It just looks so cool. In my head, they're all frozen. Um, it's a frozen city, you see. Each of these was buildings and tower blocks. Yes, that's where I'm going with this. You could actually probably live in one of these. If you spawned him and wanted to start it, you could probably... Because it's glass, so it's quite easy to break. You could hollow it out and make a home in there. That would be lovely. Well, I say glass, it's ice. But you know what I meant. So I'm hoping if we go through here, we'll come to a more snowy area with trees. That's my thinking. Because there isn't actually a lot in this biome. There's Bernie Rabbit. Hello, Bernie Rabbit. But not a lot else. And as I say, we're not taking we're not taking chances this time. 
I'm going to be very cautious. We need to gather a load of dirt as well so I can make a dirt tower to live on at night if necessary. Uh, if you want to know what shaders that I'm using, it is in the description below. I forgot to mention that earlier in the video. But it does make such a difference. The shadows and the lighting and everything are just beautiful. I'm going to put my sword. I, I, I just feel safer having a sword in my hand. The armor we did have, I've already lost. <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, ooh. Ooh, what's that then? Ah, trees. Ever Is that an evergreen? It doesn't look evergreeny to me. Let's find out. I just need saplings and the wood I don't need. I can grow my own. I can't even reach that piece. That's a little annoying. Wait, wait, wait. There we go. Is that enough to reach it? It is quite nice inside this tree. There we go. So we're going to let that one drop its saplings. We're going to try and find higher ground a minute. Just to see what we can see. So that looks like a different biome over there. Got an ice island over that way. Ooh. Ooh. What? There's something over there. That look. Wait, is there, is there a structure over there? Am I being... Am I imagining it? No, there's definitely a structure. Okay, we're going to go that way. There's a structure over that way. I see soldiers. I was on my way to that structure and look, there's soldiers walking over here. We should, there's three of them. We should probably avoid them, right? The likelihood of taking them on is slim. I'm going to go across the ice, I think. That's what I'm thinking. You keep going that way. You keep going that way and stay away. I hope they're not heading towards me. Because that would be a little annoying. Please don't go and attack my base when I'm not there. I'm going to say we're going to be okay. We're going to be... Where are they coming from then? Is there like an enemy encampment somewhere? Don't know. I'm going to head to that structure. Because I'm really intrigued what it is. We are hungry. So let's eat a bit of pumpkin pie. And a piece of bread. Oh, a tiny little bit left. Maybe... A, wait, we got some cooked mutton. We did get two saplings. Um, I could have got more, but I didn't want to hang around. I wanted to see what that structure was. The water is so pretty now. So pretty. Where's it gone? Oh, it's behind that tree. So let's head that way. I'm keeping an eye out for soldiers. Because I feel like that would be a bad thing. There is another tree over here, actually. So if we cut that down at the same time. If we cut this down, we'll be okay, right? Because then whilst we're exploring this structure, this can drop saplings. Come on. Get... Oh, I never reached the top one, ever. Okay, let's put those back then. We're going to go to there. See, I can actually live in this tree at night. I think I'd be quite safe. There we go. That's that one done. Carry on. What the... What is it? What... It looks like... Is it a gate? I'm going to say it... It looks like that leads up to it, so you would walk into it. It looks like it's seen better days. Can we harvest this? Oh. Oh, no, it doesn't like that. I'm going to look in the crate first. Ooh, golden leggings. Let's take that. And is that a golden shovel? I'll take that as well. Why not? What's this? Obsidian. I have absolutely no idea what I can do with that. And fire charge. Again, no idea. Let's put our golden leggings on because that's bound to be better than... Oh, look. They're all flashy and, and... I like it. What's this stuff? That is... Never... Never rack. Okay. So I'm presuming we need this. I'm going to say. I do want some of these walls for building, actually. These things. So I might take all of that. There we go. Lovely. Do I want the storage box? Probably not. But I might take it just because it's there. Why make something when you can just take it from there? This stuff I can't break, right? 
I'm guessing I need a better pickaxe. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be breaking. That's fine. I do want all of this, though. All of this. I'm just going to take the gate apart. Don't know whose it is, but it's mine now. There we go. Lovely. Piece by piece. Excellent. Do I want those as well? No, I think I'm okay. I think I'm okay. We're going to pick that up. So we did get a different type of tree again, which is nice. One different type of tree. So I reckon if we can find another one, we're going to have a bit of a variation. Is that gold up there? Ooh, I want the gold. Uh, you, come out. You come out, you come out. <laughs> now it's just magically floating. That's fine, I can live with that. I'm going to put a piece of wood there. Can I reach the gold from here? No. I can't even see it. No, okay. Urgh. Yes, all the way up. Perfect. Okay. Let's see what we've got here. Thank you. Thank you. Now I can definitely take that gold, right? Yes. What's that then? Oh, iron bars. Oh, so... Now I'm thinking I should probably stay up here. Now this magic gate is just floating. Can I take the glowy one at least? Wow. Is it breaking down? It looks like it's breaking down. I'm thinking it's not going to let me harvest it though. I'm thinking it's just going to disappear. Oh no, it's just not letting me harvest it. It is morning. I'm thinking... That's not a struck. No, that's a hill. So that's where we were. That's the gate I've just ripped apart. But it almost looks like there's a gate over that way. Oh, watch the hole. What's down there? Wait, wait, wait. Is that just grass? Am I getting used to my shaders? Yeah, that's just grass, right? <laughs> yes. Yes, it is. <laughs> oh, I was like, ah, ooh. New block. It's not a new block at all. I'm just easily excited. Wait, where was I saying? That way, it looks like there's another gate. Can you see that right in the distance on that hill? I think we're going to go that direction. I'm going to put my sword out just in case we run into any of those blokes. Because that would be the last thing I need. There's a nice evergreen forest on the left. Some Bernie rabbits. That's the one we've ripped apart. I'm sure that looks like what we're... Another gate. It might not be. I might. It might just be a random piece of dirt. Well, I'm heading this way anyway. I just have to remember home is on my right at the moment. <gasps> There's a tower over there. Is home on my right? No, it can't be because... Oh, there's a tower. That is just a piece of dirt, isn't it? Yes, is the answer. Yeah, it's just a random piece of dirt. It looks like a gate. Well, that's just mean. <gasps> Look at those spiky hills in the distance. Ooh. And what's that over there? I really want to see what that tower is, but... I know that there's a load of bad guys out here, because we've just passed some of them. And what's the betting? That's where they're coming from. Yes, I think that's the plan. We're going to explore that tower. I'm getting distracted. My entire plan in this episode was to build. That is so cool. There's so much ice and snow around. We're not getting very far. My, in my entire plan was to build my house today. And then I go and find a tower. And I'm like, ah, ooh, let's go and have a look at the tower. Oh, <gasps> polar bears. I want a polar bear. Ooh, do you eat meat? I've only got cooked meat. Uh-oh. Hello, Mr. Polar Bear. Um, I am a friend. Friend. No, don't. Always oh, looking at me. I don't like it. Like, polar bears could just rip my face off if they wanted, right? Yes, very much so. Now, am I putting the chest down? I'm going to say yes. It would make sense to put a chest down, wouldn't it? Rather than just walk up to a tower and it's probably full of enemies. 
There's the tower. Okay. Do you know what? We'll put the bed down. We've got a chest because we picked it up. So that's good. We're going to put you there. We are going to fill this with everything we've found. Like so. All of it apart from my sword. Because I feel I'm... Oh no, maybe a bit of food. We might fill our food up first. Oh, we're so close. Look at that forest. That forest looks amazing. No one seems to be coming to get me. Let's do it. Let's do it. We may lose our armor. But we know everything else is safe. Ooh, what is this place? I'm going to say it's their base, right? No one seems to be around. Oh, someone's around. I can hear someone. Oh, polar bear. Help me, polar bear. There's no way in. <gasps> Open it. Oh, no. The polar bear's attacking me. No, 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 no. <laughs> Please, polar bear. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm going to keep going up. There's nothing in here. This tower is empty. Oh, there's something. I don't know what this is, but I'm taking it. <gasps> Ooh. Wait, can we take all of this? Yes, do it. Mine. Thank you very much. Anything else in here? Is that it? I risked my life for that. Oh. No, no. <laughs> you stay down there. I really want to let those things out. Can I do that? They're in cages, bless them. Look. What's that? Trip wire hook. Ah, oh, okay. I'm going to venture down. I'm going to go for it. I'm hoping we can release them and the bear's gone. Why is the bear not attacking them? Is he still after me? Yes. Why is the polar bear after me? That's so annoying. Now I'm stuck in here. If I get down, that polar bear's going to have me. Oh. Oh, there's loads of them now. I don't like it. Ha-ha. <laughs> we could just run. There's loads. I don't know what is in those little huts. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, I'm going to go for it. Ready? Can I jump from this height? Yep. Go. Okay, that's just storage huts. There's nothing in there. I feel sorry for those prisoners, but I've got to go. <laughs> Run for your life. Now I have to remember where we... Oh, they're coming. They're coming. That polar bear took me by surprise, look. That was the issue. Oh, it's almost night time. Keep running. Oh, he's still following. He's still following. That's fine, because if he kills me by my bed, I'm happy with that. I can live with that. I don't know where my bed is. I'm sure it's over here somewhere. It doesn't help my bed's white. Oh, there's another polar bear. Avoid the polar bear. <laughs> Oh, I should have kept some... Oh, wait. They gave me wood, didn't they? I could just use the wood. Dark oak logs. He says, find me somewhere to build. <laughs> Uh-oh. Okay. Is he still after me? I know he is. I know he is. We're very much in the forest now. And it's getting dark. Of course it's getting dark. Okay. Time to just make a makeshift tower just to protect myself. So after all of our exploration, I have been growing some spruce trees. So if we come over to this crate over here, I've brought my bed out as well. So every time it goes to night, I can skip through as I'm building. We've got a nice selection of different color materials, lots of stones, which we're going to use. I'm going to try and go medieval. 
So ultimately, we need our spruce logs to start with. And pos... Yeah, so we're going to have some spruce. We're going to have some... Can I put that stone there? Yes, I can. Don't need those seeds. Uh, yeah, we'll have some of that because that's a nice variation. I might keep the dirt on me. Um, what else do we need? Probably those as well. Let's put the spruce uh, saplings in there. As you can see, I've got a lot more off the trees we've cut down. I'm probably going to have all of this, if I'm honest. The mossy ones can stay, actually. We'll keep those for a different time. But let's just put whatever we've got in here. Okay. So first off, we probably want to plan a layout. I'm thinking this might not be big enough, but we're going to give it a go. So ultimately, I don't need a very big area here. So if I go... Ooh, for the main part... How about we go there? That seems good. And then we can go there, which will give us three across to there. We, we can move the path. The path is not the most important part at the moment. So what did we leave? We leave, left a one block gap. Is that big enough? Probably. We're only going for a small house to start with. Okay. So let's put some stone in then. So that's going to come from there to there. I don't know how well this is going to work out. I'm going to say we'll come three that way. One, two, three. I probably want some sort of extension over this side. So let's go. Let's go four that way. Uh, what's that? Three, four, five there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Something is attacking me. Where did you come from? Mr. Zombie. <laughs> that caught me by surprise. I've actually turned my sound off, so I didn't hear him creeping up on me. It's because I've got um, LED lights going around my desk. And for some reason, when I put my speakers down low, it goes, do you know what? We're going to play up at this point. So we could just have a small house like this. I feel like I don't like the shape though. I want a little bit on the back maybe. So. Could we cut this back? Or could we could go into the. We could have a, a, a separate layer. We could come up to here. Which may not be a bad plan. It'll take me some time to clear it all out. But if we come this way. Right, let's take that out there a minute. And we'll come right up to... I probably don't want to clear all that out. So how about we just go to there? That seems like a good plan. Then we can bring you, sir. Are going to come this way. So ultimately, that could have been wood as well. Inside, but that's fine. We'll work with it. You're going to come this way. We're going to go to about there, I think. This may work. It may not. I've never done a... Sort of a raised area, but we're going to give it a go. And then you can come one, two. I think you should be quite long, right? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, we want odd numbers as well. So so odd numbers is, is the best way to build. From the tips I've got offline. So if you're coming down here, you're going to be coming to there, right? Oh, which is where we've got to. Ooh, so I do need my dirt, see? I do need the dirt. Let's put that in there a minute. Let's get rid of this. Use your spade, it'll be much quicker. Perfect. So you're going to go to there, which is the edge. I'm actually... Yeah, we'll, we'll stick with that for the time being. We'll go to there a minute. And then we want to put stone there, 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 there. We'll mix and match the stone up and make different textures... As we go along. But at the moment I'm just trying to get a floor plan set out. So we could do that. That works. We could dig this out in all fairness. Which I might do. Let's just get this foot plan in. I'm thinking we'll go straight across. Here. Or we could make this quite big. We could. Oh. We've changed texture. I don't mind changing texture. We're going to do that anyway. So if I come to about, what's that, four? Okay, we're going to go four. 
to there. We're then gonna come... Wait, where did you start? It doesn't need to be symmetrical. But in my head, I want it to be symmetrical. So here would be exactly where we want to be. Lovely. So you go in there. Uh, let's grab probably one of those for now. Do that. Lovely. Might put another one of those in. One in there. Couple more. And that's our floor plan, he says. I might bring this one out a little bit more. So let's take those out. Like that. And we're going to bring that out. Maybe just one more. Oh no, that's in the wrong place. See, I've wasted a stone now. Because that goes back to cobblestone, which we've changed it from cobblestone. It's one of the most annoying things when you've put all that effort in. So if you go there, you go there. And then this can go across there like that. And that's good. And then basically we just need to build up with each tower. Wait there, it's getting dark. So ultimately, if we say the first, this floor will just be full of flooring. So you don't claim that. So one, one, two, three, four. So say four high, like so. Of course, it got dark quick. Let's go and have a let's go and have a sleep. <laughs> we'll put a log down at the same time. This is like organized chaos. <laughs> let's wait. Let me pick this log up. One thing I have learned with logs which we're going to use on this build, is we can strip this. So if I right-click on it, it strips it like that. And that's lovely. Really nice. So ultimately, we need to do the same here. We need to go one, two... And we can build our wall up at the same time. So ultimately, if I go like that, that gives us a step up. So we can add a couple more onto there, or one more onto it. And then we're going to put a stone in here. Lovely. And then that should be right. Okay, so we've grew some more trees because they keep running out of uh, wood. But we've started to fill it in. We filled in the floor. So now it's all level. Uh, this area, I'm undecided if I want to go up a step or, or dig that down so it matches. I don't know. But this is the plan with the walls. Basically, we're going to have three different types of sort of stone. And we're just going to mix it up a bit like that. So on this wall here, this has got a beautiful view. So I'm literally just picking random places, putting these in like that. Then we're going to go normal brick. Now, what sort of window do I want here? Probably, probably a good window. So if I put one of those there, we'll have a layer of three bricks. I might go a big window. I might. Let's do it. Let's go a big window just to take advantage of that view. So up there, we're going to have stone. Then we're going to have probably that one there. We'll have another one of those brick ones and then that. And of course, I put it in the wrong place when I start recording. And that ruined that and turned it back to cobblestone. That is quite a big window. We're very much taking advantage of the views here. That one, not so much. But there is no view that way. So we haven't put a window there because I don't see the point. So ultimately, I'm going to go around, I'm going to do all of this and fill in all the walls, and we'll end up with a downstairs area. Okay, building's been interrupted, we're under attack. Oh my god. These guys are ha relentless, they just keep popping up. I, We may be in a bad area to live. This may have gone terribly wrong, because they just keep coming. No, I haven't lost all my stuff. Are you having a laugh? I can't cope. I can't cope with it. I'm just going to run. I'm going to run and try and save myself. These guys are relentless. They, they're just following. And not only am I dealing with them, I'm dealing with zombies and creepers now. I can't cope. Why, why, why do they keep attacking me? <laughs> oh, I've probably lost a load. Look at the arrows everywhere. Leave me alone. Can I go in my base? Would that save me? Is that something I can do? Can they get in my base? Hopefully not. That's what I'm hoping. Wow. I, they're doing my head in, if I'm honest, these raiders. I don't... Like... Yes, I may have gone to their base. But they just constant... Look, I've lost... I've lost so much. I can't cope. I can't cope with it. <laughs> 
I'm going to cry. I'm going to sit in my cave and cry. Hopefully, I would have figured out how to get rid of them in the next episode and we can carry on building our house. Um, and if you've enjoyed this episode, hit that like button. If you haven't done already, please subscribe. It does help the channel. If you know how I can deal with these people, let me know in the comments below. And until next time, I'll see you again.